So this software is called Punch Home Design Complete. This is the uncompleted design that I've been working on for my house. Um, I still have a ways to go, but this is what I got so far. Um, here's the front entry, the, the front yard, and um, you can get really technical. This is the 2D view that you see right now. You can see that you know, once you walk into the home, there's the formal dining here. There's a bedroom over here. Um, you know, we have the two side yards. And then, you know, you get into the living room, and here's the stairs going upstairs. And then uh, we have the patio in the back of the garage. Now, let's go to the 3D view and see how things look. So, let's go to the person view. So, when you first pull up to the home here, this is what you'll see once you get out of your car. Um, we want to put some planters in in the front yard here. Uh, all, all the plants that you see here are native to Texas, so they grow up really well in Texas soil, and they've all been researched. You know, we have a couple succulents here, um, and uh, it's best to come up with a color scheme. So the color scheme for the front is white, silver, blue, and green, and a little bit of purple. So, for example, we have these giant purple fountain grass here. And then this is all a uh, Texas native plant called catmint um, that's over here. And then we have some uh, vertigo or black mondo grass in the front. So it goes black, blue, and then green. And then towards the front entry here, as you're walking up to the front, uh, we have some more plantings. And this plant, I forgot what it's called, but it's a white plant. So, and it's, uh, it'll stay year round. It's an evergreen plant. They call it evergreen, but it's actually white. So it'll go white, uh, deep purple, and then the green here. And here's our two little dog statues that we already have right now. So the idea is to do a front patio uh, on both sides, and as well as a area for you to walk to. We have this pathway on the side, on each side of the house. Everything is very symmetrical. That will lead you down. Um, to this area here and this is the only grass that we'll have in the front and this grass is called cutlass grass uh, and it's called cutlass because you have to cut it less um, it's the actual grass that you can get here in Texas and you only have to cut it about once every couple months and I'll probably hit it with the edger and that's it that's all the maintenance that I'll have to do in the front yard besides just trimming the shrubs so once you get down to the end of the pathway here um, let's kind of look around. So here's the side yard here. This path will lead you down to a statue at the very end. Here's some dwarf cypress trees that will stay about this size. Again, it's very low maintenance, so only need to be cut uh, about once a year. And this is a horsetail here, called the horsetail plant. And then this is all wildflower. It's not going to be grass. And then towards the back here, you see that we have these coverings that will... Uh, are for privacy from the, the neighbors and they'll be covered in vines and then at the very end we have this really pretty statue here. Uh, once we turn around and go back around to the front of the house, um, you can see that on both sides of the house uh, we'll have these water features that are in the front so you can sit out here with your coffee in the morning enjoy the water feature here and um, then we have some more Texas native bushes here and some more reeds here for the little pond here. And <laughs> I like this little peeing statue, so I put him there. And so once you actually get inside the house, I haven't done any of the interior yet, but I've done the basic layout of everything. So once you get in the house, here's the formal dining. And whoop, there's the kitchen over there that I haven't set up yet and the stairs going upstairs and then the office is over there and there's the bathroom so you can see you can add a lot of th things to this design now let's go back outside and just look at kind of like a helicopter view of what I've done so looking at this from above you can see that you know everything's very symmetrical um, the design as you're walking up, you know, you have the two pillars here, 
there's this small space for grass in the front and these two pathways along the side that'll lead you down to the side yards. Uh, there's a small bridge on either side because we have um, uh, the drain pipes coming down so they'll tuck ni nicely right under the bridges and, and flow off uh, the side yard and run down. And you know, you'll have your water feature here on both sides that you can enjoy. And like I said, these are all Texas native plants, so uh, they'll grow really, really well here. And this is from like the neighbor's view. So when the neighbors get home, you know, uh, that's what they'll see. And here's from the other side here. You know, and we'll create these little arbors here uh, to walk through to kind of set off the pathway to the backyard. And I haven't finished the patio yet or the roofing on the house, so that's that, it still needs to be done. But the basic landscaping in the front is done and the fence is up in the back. So I'll just need to do the, the landscaping in the back and do the finish off the roof and do the interior design in the house. And that's it. Thanks for watching.